reading. I just want, I have plenty of scriptures, but I guess I'll begin with the one that uh, we'll begin to build from again, and I'm referring to you today as rulers, all right? And I want you to really understand your rules. So. All right, Isaiah chapter 63. Isaiah 63. Certainly, if you don't have a Bible, we can give you one. I guess in the future we'll have to give you some phones. Is <laughs> anybody reading it? No, don't do that. All right. 63. And I'm going to begin. Now I'm reading from the Amplified Version, so if you have that on your phone, you can. It will be amplified if you don't. King James Version will read as well. Okay? Verse 3. Are you, are you with me? Amen. If you haven't, wait up if you don't. All right. He says, I have trodden the wine trough alone, and of the peoples there was no one with me. I also trod them in my anger and trampled them in my wrath. And their lifeblood is sprinkled on my garments, and I stained all my clothes. For the day of vengeance against ungodliness was in my heart. And my year of redemption of those who put their trust in me, the year of my redeemed, has come. I looked, but there was no one to help. And I was amazed and appalled that there was no one to uphold truth and right. Amen. I'm going to stop there. Amen. Amen. Well, he will be seated. The presence of the Lord. Remember we talked about all the wonders of heaven and the powerful things that our gift will bring us into. Again, it's your gift and your calling that really needs to be your focus over these next few weeks. If you haven't discovered it yet, it's okay. God will reveal it to you. I, I assure you he will. But he needs you to focus on it. Some of us need to rediscover our gifts and our callings. And realize when God gives something, it's with purpose. Certainly if he has purposed something in us, we, should, we certainly should not just neglect it or ignore it. But realize that that gift is for somebody's life. Thank you, Lord. And so it is then that I want to talk to God's order today. The subject is God's order. And I'll speak from the order of creation, family first. Then came government, his laws, his word, and then church. Interesting that church is last, but that was the order, and still is the order. We just read in the scriptures and began to talk about truth, and there was really...